might be hard to believe, but March has now become the start of the summer blockbuster season, and this year we have two action sequels to start it. We have Olympus Has Fallen sequel London Has Fallen and Divergent series Allegiant. But really hoping to make a splash at the box office is Batman vs Superman Dawn of Justice. He has the power to wipe out the entire human race. Batman fighting Superman will bring to mind Frank Miller's seminal graphic novel The Dark Knight Returns, with an appearance by Wonder Woman and Aquaman confirmed and rumours of a Flash cameo. The question is, is it too many heroes in one film? It certainly worked for Marvel's Avengers, so DC will be hoping the same happens here. Beyond these blockbuster films, March promises a lot for horror fans too, who've been sorely lacking in titles since Halloween last year. March has The Other Side of the Door, the Witch and the Boy, starring The Walking Dead's Lauren Cohen. And this is our son, Rod. <laughs> At the other end of the spectrum, we have director Charlie Kaufman's Oscar-nominated Anna Lisa. And unlike anything else you'll see this month, we have UK director Ben Wheatley's High Rise, a dystopian sci-fi film set in a tower block. How's the high life? Prone to fits of mania, narcissism, and power failure. I've seen the film twice and I still don't know what to make of it. And the less you know, the better going in, as it will shock and surprise in equal measure. Be sure to check it out. You can book tickets for all these films at myview.com and I'll be answering questions below, so let us know what you think. Enjoy the big screen entertainment.